What's up everyone? Welcome back to some Subnautica. We are back. I'm still in here with the Emperor Leviathan, but we are about to head out. We're going to head up to the surface here. I have the blueprint for the Neptune platform up here on top. So we're going to need a lot of titanium, a computer chip, and some lead. That's not too bad, but that's just step one of the process. Actually, it's step two of the process because the first thing we're going to do is when we go through this portal, we have to go into the other alien base and then we have to disable the weapon. So that way when we launch our rocket, we don't get blown up. Oh, the little babies are here in the shallows. All right. Ooh, some silver ore. I'll take that for sure. I don't know if I'm going to need silver ore for any of the Neptune, but I'm pretty sure it's four different parts. I think it, the platform might be one part, and then I think there's three parts to the rocket. So we're going to need a lot of resources. It's going to take some time to gather all of this, and the prawn suit's going to be the best way to gather resources in bulk so we might as well grab whatever ore we can while we're over here by the mountain we might need some silver but i doubt we need an insane amount of silver so i'm just gonna leave it at that because i want room in my inventory for things like gold and titanium maybe even some crystal Pop up in the moon pool. I'll just leave the prawn suit in the moon pool. That's fine. Is this where we disable the weapon or is that in the upper chamber? I think this is it. Cause we're in the lower chamber with the moon pool. Yeah, right here. Let's turn this weapon off. Nice, we shut down this whole alien base. We have to build the rocket on the surface. And the thing that would make the most sense is to build it right beside our shallow space. So that way we have a fabricator and stuff right there. Because obviously we're going to have to craft the titanium ingots and blah, 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 computer chips, da, 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 da. So we're going to have to do some crafting. So we need to, I can't talk. We need to be near a fabricator. So we might as well just build it at our old base. That's the best place for it. I'm just gonna gather some resources along the way because I have no idea what I need for all of this stuff, but I do know I cleared that base out entirely. So there is nothing left over there. So we're gonna need a little bit of everything. We're gonna need some gold. We're gonna need some silver. We, I mean, we might need some diamonds. I don't know. I don't know. I, I have no idea. I have no idea what we need. I just want to gather a little bit of everything, and then that'll help me not have to make so many trips out to get stuff. I just really hope I don't need ion cubes, but I might. I really might. Actually, I might have ion cubes in my prawn suit now that I'm thinking about it. Gold, I'll take this, because I probably will need several computer chips, so I probably will need a lot of gold. Here's another thing of gold, but I don't think I'll need that much gold. 
So I think I'm just gonna head out of here. Grab some titanium along the way for Welcome sure. Oop, more scrap metal. How full is my inventory? It's not too bad. How about the prawn suit? Okay, that's pretty full, but I do have ion cubes in there. I thought I did. Cool, so if I need the ion power cells for the rocket, I should be fine. It would kind of be weird for ion cells to be in the blueprint of the rocket, and here's why. The ion technology we discovered from the aliens? So, I mean, it could improve the blueprint, but why would that already be in the blueprint if humanity didn't know about the ion cubes before then? That would be a little weird. So, I don't think they require the ion power cells, but the rocket probably requires some sort of power cell, right? Maybe just a regular one? I might need stalker teeth, too. I might need enameled glass. Here's our base that we haven't been to in forever. But we have finally returned. Welcome aboard, Captain. Welcome aboard, Captain. Time to make some titanium uh, ingots. And then I'll grab water because my inventory is too full right now. Not storage. Gosh, putting that storage right by this was a dumb idea. Nice, that's both titanium ingots. A problem I have is I don't have any copper whatsoever for a copper wire. I do have gold, but I have no uh, table coral, so I'll have to go get that. I mean, that's right outside. That's not too difficult but it's still a thing that I have to go do nonetheless got plenty of med kits though that's nice well let's go ahead and use this one and then grab water before we start taking damage and go ahead and drink Rifles that stabilizing. Go ahead and take another water. Go ahead and drink that. Okay, so we got no more water. That's fine. I thought maybe it would just do another one real quick, but I guess not. Inventory's too full. Drop off the majority of this stuff for now. Because right now I don't need lithium. I don't need all this. I don't need these power cells i don't need scanners don't need habitat builders don't need a repair tool don't need a laser cutter don't need a purple towel i don't need any of that i don't need any of that we're good we're good we're almost done we just gotta gather resources and get off this planet Time to go find, co Ooh, let's go to sleep so that way the sun will be up. Time to find copper and what was the other one? Oh, I need table coral, which is easy. And I'm sure I'm going to need even more acid mushroom spores you can actually grow acid mushrooms interesting I didn't know that but I did not mean to get those now I need two copper if I find more scrap metal I'm gonna pick it up because I am absolutely certain that I will need more titanium for the rest of the pieces of the rocket Oh, I also need four lead while I'm out here. I forgot about that. Well, there's one. Okay, we got both copper, right? That was both of them, right? No, that was just one. One copper, one titanium. So I need one more copper. I need three more lead. 
And my sea glide died. I knew I should have grabbed some of those batteries. There's three lead. One more. Yeah, I didn't expect to get back to back lead. That would have been kind of crazy. Getting extra copper, that's nice. Extra titanium, always good. More extra copper, more extra titanium. I need to, did I not use that health pack? My health is super low. Lead, no, gold. I kind of figured it would be gold because I hadn't gotten a gold in the one. I just really wanted it to be lead. Oh, as I was going to get oxygen, I got the last piece of lead that I needed. Perfect. Now it's going to be a slow swim home, but I'll be able to get a new battery when I get home. And we'll build the Neptune platform, and then we'll be able to use the Sea Glide for whatever things we need next. Welcome aboard, Captain. Welcome aboard, Captain. Well... Time for a copper wire and a computer chip. And I said that I don't need a habitat builder, but I actually do. <laughs> Duh, that was dumb. And we're gonna grab batteries as well. Put that battery in, take these out. Well, how do I build the Neptune platform? I guess it's not a habitat builder. Is it gonna be, sorry. Uh, I guess the habitat builder doesn't build the Neptune platform. Maybe the mobile vehicle bay. Ah, yes, right here. Incredible. And then I guess I'll get a new blueprint for the rest of the Neptune. I think there's actually going to be a console on this platform, if I remember correctly, where you build the rest of it. But I don't remember for sure. Big splash. This is it. Plasteel ingot, copper wire, and lubricant. Perfect. That shouldn't be too difficult. I have the copper. It, it was a copper wire, right? right? I'm already second guessing myself. Plasteel ingot, copper wire, lubricant. I have everything that I need for the copper wire. We're in the creep vine forest right now, so we can easily grab a creep vine seed cluster. And then we have lithium in our base. I think I need more titanium though. Drop it, my guy. Thank you. One more piece should be enough. Oh, actually I have plenty. Wow, I didn't realize I already had a couple pieces in my inventory. Let's just go get this crafted. I'm sure I'll have to look for more later, but I don't need to look for more right now, so why do that? Two lithium. This is part two out of four. Ooh, well, it's nighttime. Let's go to sleep. I don't like working in the dark when I don't have to. You're not tired enough yet to go to sleep. Huh? But it's dark outside. What are you talking about? What do you mean I'm not tired enough to go to sleep? It's nighttime. There we go. Keep calm and kitty on. Time to construct part one. Whoa!
This is just the part where I go up to get on the rocket and it holds the rocket in place. This isn't even part of the rocket. I think the platform was step one, that's step two. And then I think there's two more pieces of the rocket. Maybe there's three more. The boosters. Nickel, aerogel, and plasteel. Nickel? Nickel? Are you serious? Nickel? Why? Oh, that sucks. That sucks so bad. I don't even think I have the aerogel. I hate that. I hate that a lot. I have nine titanium, one short of the plasteel ingot I need. Let's go grab a titanium real quick. Make the plasteel ingot before I go down there. To get nickel and gel sacks. That's what I need is nickel and gel sacks. And, well, I guess I need a couple rupees as well for the aerogel. But those can all be found kind of in a pretty similar area. Where'd that piece of metal go that y'all had? Oh, there's one. I'll take the stalker tooth as well. Okay, well there's three pieces of metal over here. My inventory's full. I knew I should have emptied my inventory. I was unloading the prawn suit and I was like, oh, I'll go grab one piece of titanium. Of course, it's the time where I find like 20 pieces. Then we need two more lithium. And I only have one. Uh, we do need a wiring kit. And then I need to put as much of this crap in here as I can. This sucks. I guess I'll take the prawn suit so I have extra storage and oxygen and all that. I honestly will probably take the prawn suit down and then come back in the sea glide. Not sea glide, sea moth. Just so that way I get back faster. Well, we refound all the scrap metal, which I am gonna snag up. There's some more scrap metal. Coming back to the lost river biome to look for more nickel oh i remember i actually found a huge chunk of nickel somewhere over here one time is this copper I, you know what? i'll take some copper i don't know how much more copper i'm gonna need so i'll take some of that i think that's silver down there i don't like being this close to this warper though Especially considering that I didn't heal. That wasn't smart. Should have healed up. That looks like gold. That's silver. I think that's also silver. The titanium would be nice. Wait, what is that? What is that one? That's also silver. Dang it. Well, I'll take the titanium. I'm gonna need some of that for sure. And there's a gel sack as well. That's terrifying. Just please stay away from me. I just want this. I can farm those if I want. I'd rather just get a bunch of them 
Is this also silver? Why is there so much silver? Wait, yeah, that's silver. There's another gel sack and some rubies. Oh, I think that one's nickel. That one right there. Yep, this is what I need. I just got attacked by the ghost leviathan. Ooh, I'm taking some damage, that's for sure. I need this ruby and this gel sack. Because I need, I think, two gel sacks for two arrow gel. I think it's one gel sack and two rubies. So I think I need four rubies in total. But I will pick up extra of both just in case. Probably don't need all of this in my inventory, but that's fine. I'll probably go down to my other base over here, because like I said, I'm probably going to come back in the sea moth just because it's faster than trying to come back in the prawn suit here. Is this more nickel? No, that's silver. Again, there's so much silver. I think I have everything I need, though. I will pick up some gel sacks. Do I have one more? I do have one more space. Grab that. And, oh man, there's another one. Let's transfer some stuff for now. Grab this. So I'm probably gonna make up the aerogel before I come back. Where is my sea moth? I've been seeing the icon for my sea moth and now it's gone. Where did it go? I think this is more nickel. What happened? Cause I could see my sea moth and now it's gone. Did, did my sea, oh, there it is right there. Okay, it's this way, 500 meters down. 400 meter, oh, 400 meters away, not down. I'm just being dumb, okay. I was about to say, it can't even go that deep. It can only go 900 meters deep. Time to do some crafting to free up inventory Welcome space. I still need lithium though, don't I? I need one more lithium. There's lithium around here, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure there's a couple big pieces of lithium. I actually might have some lithium in this base because I don't, I didn't take everything out of this base. So there might be some in here already. That's a ton of lead. I can definitely use that lead for sure. There's lithium. Let's go ahead and do a plasteel ingot then. And then I need to figure out what all I'm taking with me up to the surface. We will take benzene because I don't know if I'm going to need that. I really don't. I don't think I'm going to need it for any part of the Neptune. But if I do, I don't want to come back to get it so let's start loading up the sea moth with all the stuff that we can oh i should craft the arrow gel six oh there's ten of the okay i should make another titanium ingot let's load this up with some copper benzene boom boom do 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 okay zoom zooms full so once my inventory is full, that's all I can carry. Arrow gel, I need two. And I'm not gonna make more than I need to because I might need the rubies for something else. So I don't wanna waste the rubies. Got four more spots in my inventory. What else is worth taking? Lead, lead is good. I think uh, diamonds and lead. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, I said I was gonna do this. Boom, another titanium ingot. That frees up even more space. Take the magnetite, take the crystals, take a couple of those. I don't, I don't think I need that stuff, but we'll take it. And then we're gonna zoom zoom our way to the surface whoa there's one of those crab things i haven't seen one of those this entire playthrough i was wondering where they've been 
I think there's a habitat <laughs> that you can go to that has those swimming around it, and I never even went. Never even went and looked. I don't know what blueprints may have been in there, what PDAs were in there. Never found them. You can beat this game without... Like, there's a lot of stuff that you don't have to do to beat this game, but you can do. I just have to hop in the base here real quick to grab the wiring kit. And... I think that was it, right? I didn't even need a copper wire or anything. Wiring kit. Yeah, I needed a plasteel ingot, which I have now. Both aerogel, perfect. Time to head back to the Neptune platform and build this next piece. Nice. I think it's just one more piece, the other half of the rocket. And I might have everything I need for it. I'm not sure what I need, but I have a lot of stuff. So hopefully I have enough and I don't have to go look for anything else. Done. Crystallized cave sulfur. Two ion power cells. I'm glad I grabbed the kyanite. I need the kyanite. Wow. Wow. I'm so glad I grabbed that. Crystalline sulfur. I, I think I have that. I think I brought that all with me. I really, 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 really hope so. There's one. Don't need any of this. I mean, I don't even really need the nickel. All right. Hmm. No, I, oh my gosh. I didn't bring it. I didn't bring it with me. What? Where did it go? Is it? Is it in my Cyclops? I have to go back down there again. What do I need for the ion power cells at the very least? Ion battery, ion power cell. Two ion batteries and a silicon rubber. Gold, silver, ion cube. Two batteries, so I need another gold and another silver. Don't need any of the copper, the lead, the salt. I don't even think it said I need titanium or diamonds or rubies or magnetite or this. Uh, I don't think I need nickel. Is it just the cave sulfur? Is that? I think it's just the crystalline cave sulfur. I think that's the only thing I need now. Oh, I need to actually make the power cells. And then I need a plasteel ingot. Okay. Well, we can make the silicon rubber for the power cells very fast. Ah, uh, it's the seed clusters that I need. Dang it. I guess I still need two lithium. Uh, wait, there's one. I need one lithium. I think it's just one seed cluster that I need. At least I'm in the sea moth, which is faster than the prawn suit, but dang! It sucks to have to go all the way back down there where I just came from. <laughs> uh, I hear a warper on my tail, but I'm pretty sure I'll be able to get away. Pretty sure I saw one piece of the crystalline cave sulfur right through this threshold right at the edge of the green here so the first one should be pretty easy to get and then hopefully we can find two more super fast because i already have one i only need four i think i see two right here oh wait no just one this is probably the one that i was talking about got that one 
Oh, the crab squid thing followed me. Dang. Luckily, it didn't get the EMP off on me. The heck? And now there's a warper here? Man. Getting dogged on right now. They all teaming up on me. They hate me because I'm about to get off the planet and they're stuck here. There's one. After this, I just need one more. Oh, I almost forgot. I need a lithium. Oh. That is that. Here's some more nickel, but I am done with that. Done with nickel. Don't need any more nickels. And there's the last piece of our crystalline cave sulfur. Out of here. Headed home. Bye. Bye, bye, bye. I have made it back to base for what might be the last time in this playthrough. I think I only have one thing left to craft, and that is the plasteel ingot. Oh, and the silicon rubber. And the 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 the, 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 the these, the ion power cells. So okay. I was wrong. Whatever. Oh, I need two more ion batteries as well. Okay, one, two, one, two. It's two per power cell. I was wrong. I had, I had more stuff to craft than I thought, but still, this is probably our last crafting session right here, right now. When this is done, so are we. It's just, just crazy. Then I need the plasteel ingot. That's everything. Absolutely everything. Can I sleep? Is it still nighttime enough for me to sleep? There we go. I hope this is the final piece. I'm pretty sure it is. I've been recording for an hour just trying to build this rocket. I think that's it. That it oh no there's still a cockpit enameled glass cyclops shield generator plasteel ingot computer chip that's manageable that's easy i already have the stalker two for the enameled glass wasn't my last crafting session that's fine computer chip plasteel ingot enameled glass I feel like there was something else. What else was there? I don't have lithium for a plasteel ingot. I actually don't even think I have the quartz. Oh, I do have the quartz. Okay. Cyclops shield generator. I hope the Cyclops shield generator can be... Dang it, I wanted it to be crafted at the vehicle upgrade console, but I highly doubt it because the Cyclops upgrades are all done inside the Cyclops, which I abandoned. Oh my gosh. No way. I, so I have to go back to my Cyclops in order to craft this last piece. That sucks. That sucks so bad. I mean, I can use the teleporter. Ah. Okay, we're almost there. We're almost done. We don't have much left, but I'm going to end this episode here. I've been recording for long enough, and I need to go ahead and put this one to an end. So we will be finishing off Subnautica in the next episode. And I will see you in the next one.